Welcome to Science Chorus. In this video, we are going to see about simple distillation. In the previous video, we have seen about centrifugation. So this simple distillation is also another technique where we separate out the miscible liquids according to its boiling points. So distillation is a process by which we are going to separate out the miscible liquids according to its boiling points. First of all, what is this miscible liquid known as? So miscible liquids are nothing but a homogeneous mixture. So as I already told, homogeneous mixture consists of a uniform composition. So we are having a liquid which is a homogeneous mixture. That is, we cannot separate out the or we cannot differentiate the components present in the mixture. Now, this distillation is being divided into two types. One is simple distillation. Another one is fractional distillation. Now, we are going to see only about simple distillation. As we have already told about miscible liquids, what is this uh, uh, according to its boiling points? What is this boiling point called as? So, boiling point is nothing but a temperature at which a liquid boils and changes to vapor, that is gaseous state. Now, let us take an example and uh, learn only about simple distillation. So, for example, we have taken a miscible liquid, which is a homogeneous mixture. Example, I am taking chloroform. The next will be aniline. So, this round bottom the flask. So, before that, this is the experimental setup for simple distillation, which consists of a round bottom flask, a thermometer, which gives us the temperature, uh, a condenser, and a conical flask, which separates out, separates out the other component present in the mixture. Now, we are taking the mixture of chloroform and aniline, which are in the liquid state, in the round bottomed flask. Now, this chloroform will be having a particular boiling point and this aniline will be having a particular boiling point. So, in case of simple distillation, uh, if the difference in the boiling point is more than 25 degrees Celsius, then we can easily do this simple distillation. If it is less than 25 degrees Celsius, then we will go for fractional distillation. Now, in this case, the boiling point of BP is nothing but the boiling point. Now, this chloroform, the boiling point of chloroform is 60 degrees Celsius and aniline is 184 degree Celsius. So the difference is more than 25. So easily we can separate out using the simple distillation method. Now I am taking this mixture in the round bottom of the flask and I am heating it using the Bunsen burner. Now when I start heating it, you can notice the temperature in the thermometer. So as the temperature reach, reach 60 degree Celsius, what is happening? The chloroform present in the mixture is slowly getting vaporized that is it is changing from liquid to vapor state that is gaseous state now slowly this chloroform will be changing into vapor and it will be entering into the condenser present here so what is this condenser does i need a liquid chloroform from the mixture now this vapor enters enters the condenser and it goes through it when it is going through this this condenser consists of water in this area. So this water inlet and this is water outlet. So this region is having water in it. So due to the cold temperature prevailing over this area, the vapor, what is this? The chloroform vapor is changing to what? Changing to liquid state. So the vapors of the chloroform is getting condensed and, and it is changing to liquid form and slowly this liquid is coming down and it is falling in the conical flask. So this is continuously done. So at 60 degrees Celsius, it is getting vaporized, it is getting con condensed and the liquid chloroform is coming in the conical flask. So by this process, easily you can separate out the, in this case now, chloroform is present here and now this will be having aniline. This is after the process has been done. Once this is being done, so 
I can separate out uh, the aniline separately and chloroform separately. So successfully I am separating a miscible liquid uh, by using this simple distillation. When the difference in the boiling point between the two components of a mixture is less than 25 degree Celsius, we go for fractional distillation which we will be discussing in the upcoming videos and we will also discuss about the application of distillation, where we are using this distillation. As we don't use this distillation in our uh, like uh, home or uh, like surrounding us, this will be mainly used in research purpose and in some industries. Fine, thank you.